is Review Site really a great platform to earn good money just by writing short reviews online and share your opinion, or is it a waste of time? This is a question I was recently asked by one of my viewers here on my YouTube channel, so I decided to test it for myself and in this review side review, I'll give you an inside look and show exactly what it offers because there are some very important details you need to consider before spending your time here. So before I log in, I just want to quickly go over who can join review site and who can potentially earn here by writing short reviews because you can see the countries it's available in on the sign up page. So if you just go here, you can choose between these countries currently. And if your country is not on this list here, you can currently not sign up, but they have said that they will add more countries. So maybe eventually it will be available, but currently these are the ones where you can join from. But let's then take an inside look and see if it's even worth it. So I have now logged into review site and in one sense it is a fairly simple way and it can seem very appealing at first. I definitely understand that, but there are also some very important aspects that you need to consider to find out if this is actually a good way to earn online. But let's start by going over how you can earn and then I will go into the other aspects you need to consider after. But once you logged in, you can go here to what's called logbook and then you can see the current tasks. And what review site essentially offers is that you can go to, for example, Trustpilot, Google Review and different other review sites and leave certain reviews. And the reviews will be of companies that have some kind of contact with review site and have asked them to get some positive reviews on these different platforms. And then you can see the current available tasks here and you can see how much you will earn here. And at the moment you can see I would earn one dollar for all these reviews and they really are fast to do. I will just show you in a minute how you can potentially do it, but I will also explain why I'm actually not really a big fan of this way of earning, but that takes a little bit more. So let's start by this and then I'll go over the other details later. But essentially you can just go through here and choose the ones that you find interesting. Once you found one, all you then do is to just click it. And you can then see a little bit of details here. I have blocked certain things out in here because of privacy. I'm not allowed to actually share what company names it is and all that. But the idea is that once you've found one, you can see here, you first need to then request to write a review and you just do that down here. And then it also says your request will be approved or denied in a minute. However, even though it says you will be approved and denied in a minute, I have tried if we just see here all my requests. One of them was actually approved very quickly. You can see that's accepted. The other ones here, they have been reserved for more than a week or so. So it's not always within a minute that you will be told if you can do this review or not. What you also need to be aware of is that when you are accepted, you cannot just necessarily go and do the review right away. There will be a specific date where you have to do this review. So that means that if you find a review you can do, then you have to keep an eye on the date. And then at that date, you have to go and do the review. So it requires you to kind of have a structure or a calendar where you write it. So you remember to do that because if not, you will not get paid. Unfortunately, you cannot just do it right away, which would of course have been more conveniently, but that's just how their system is. And once you've submitted the review, you will have to wait for approval. And once it has been approved, you will get the earnings into your review site account. And then a little bit later, we'll go over how you can potentially get this earnings out. But let's first now go over something that I think is the most important thing to consider before deciding if this is the right way for you to earn some extra money online. So as you can see, what you essentially will be doing is to write a review of different companies. So it's not necessarily of a company of a product you have tried yourself and they will actually also tell you exactly what to write and what kind of rating you need to give. And my issue about this is that all of us more or less, I think when we want to buy something or go somewhere or book a hotel, whatever it can be online, we look at online reviews and I really, really dislike that is possible for a company that actually does not have a good service to suddenly book a hundred or whatever five stars reviews that tells it how amazing it is by people that have never tried it. And what you need to think about what you potentially help a company doing is to get other people to spend money on them and they might be wasting their money. I'm not saying that all the companies that use this are not worth it. Definitely not. That's, I have no idea. I am not been able to, of course, test that. 
But what I'm saying is that you have no idea because they will just ask you to write a review that they have actually written and post it in your name. And other people will look at that and trust that this is a real review, but in reality, you have never tried the product or service. For me, that's just an unethical way to earn money. Yes, it's an easy $1, but think about the money that other people could potentially lose by you earning that $1. And that for me is the biggest issue here. For me, I would never ever post a fake review like that for money because I do not want other people to potentially not get what they were looking for. So this is my personal opinion about this way of making money online. And then we also get to another aspect, which is the legal aspect. And I am not a lawyer or anything like that. So I cannot say for sure how the legalities are about this, but I did find an article. And this article is a little bit old, a few years old, but it however tells something about not only the ethical issues about making money like this, but also that there was actually a owner of a site that sold fake reviews like this that was sentenced to prison and had also to pay a very big fine because of fake reviews like this. So clearly it is something that platforms like Trustpilot, a Google review, and even the authorities are looking into because it is deceitful to write fake reviews of hotels or services or products that you're just given $1 to write and you're told exactly what to write without having ever actually looked into it at all yourself. So this is definitely something you need to seriously consider before finding out if this is something you want to get involved with or not. Another thing I always look at when I look into platforms where you can earn money online is the company behind and how trustworthy it is. And here on review side, they have a couple of reviews of supposed users that tell how amazing it is to make money like this. However, I check the images of these two users here. So let's just jump here to a Google search and you can see the woman it is an image that has been caught and this image is used on many different platforms. It's from Unsplash, for example, which means it's a stock image. So they've just taken a random image and then put it for a testimonial there. And if you look at the other one, this guy here, this image is used on a lot of different platforms as well. So again, these two images are not actually their users. These are stock images. I don't know about the actual reviews, if they just made them up, but since they're just taking random images, like who knows? But in my opinion, platforms that uses tricks like this is just not transparent. And personally, I do not want to deal with any platforms that uses fake testimonials like this or any kind of tricks like this. So in case you're still interested, let's also go over how you can then supposedly get paid. And if you jump to the FAQ section, because inside the platform itself, there actually isn't really a section that clearly shows how you can get paid. But here it says that you can get paid through PayPal. So you need a PayPal account to be able to get paid. But of course, you also want to know how many reviews do you need to write to be able to get paid? What is the payout threshold? And here, the only thing they write is it depends on the review, but normally it's something between four to 10 reviews. That's a really vague answer because they should just have a clear payout threshold like basically all other sites. Usually, you know, if I earn $5, $10, whatever, you know, then I can get paid here. They say, ah, it kind of depends. You need to write between four to 10 reviews. It's again, lack of transparency. And that is a big issue about this platform in my opinion. So overall, I understand why review site can be appealing because it does not take long to earn $1 for these short reviews. But personally, I would never use an earning method like this because I think it is unethical to create fake reviews like this that can potentially affect other people or make other people lose money. In addition to that, review side, in my opinion, is just not transparent. There are many things that they do not really tell you. For example, the exact payout threshold. And also they are using these stock images for the testimonials of supposed users. So when I put all this together, yes, I understand it can seem appealing and like easy money, but I would never recommend to join a site like this. 
In my opinion, it's definitely not worth it to earn a few dollars when you at the same time can be the reason that other people maybe lose money or follow bad advice because you post a review of a product that you have never even looked into. So therefore, if you want to get paid for sharing your opinion, I would highly recommend you to join paid service sites instead where it's completely transparent, where you have to say your opinion, your honest opinion, and you're not just told what to post. That is definitely my preference preferred method. But if you want to know even more details about review site, or if you want to see a list of my top recommended paid service sites, then I have all that information on my website, paidfromservice.com. And I will leave a link to that below this video here. So you can check that out there. And if this video helped you, then make sure to hit the like button. And also remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel so you won't miss out next time there's a video with tips and tricks about how to get the most out of get paid to sites, paid service sites, and other free ways to earn some extra cash on the site online.